this weekly painting I'm going to try to do a snow base using the new um, texture, Citadel texture that is called um, Balayan Blizzard so what I want to use here is uh, it's a thing that normally I will not recommend to do is experimenting and experimenting on the base that I did for uh, how to call this the Magnus the Red uh, and I want to test the, this is no blizzard, this is no uh, texture paint so I will use this thing, this tool to apply this on the base so we are going to, to see how this, this looks like so this is how the snow looks like okay and what we are going to do is we are going to apply this on and looks like quite nice nicely done so I'm going to apply this in some parts on the base okay To simulate um, the snow, this looks quite quite a lot like virgin snow. Snow that. So we are. What I'm going to do later is I'm, I'm going to apply a little bit of um, let's call this um, gloss varnish to uh, uh, next to the snow to simulate the, the the melting. So here we have. I will apply on some areas. I will not do snow everywhere, just to I will apply on some parts because I want to look this like one of the Fenrisian walls where Magnus is stepping these days. Normally, the snow will be more accumulated uh, or will will melt later. The snow that is uh, inside or, or or inside of the crevices or in within the rocks. So this is why I'm applying the snow. You can see that. Yeah, to make big bases, this is going to be. You need a little bit, a lot of this, so it can be quite expensive if you want to do big bases. I will just do this one. So I want to apply and pop it here, and as I say, this is experimenting. Maybe you should experiment first with a less important miniature. But I just wanted to see how, how this is now. I had this idea in mind to make him looking like he's in a front vision wall. And this is why I, I decided to do this is now. Um, you, can, you can add more or less. Uh, I want to cover... I want to look quite icy. And then we are going to... I want to do another tutorial to do icicles. So I want to use... Uh, I'm going to... Uh, try to do icicles as well and I will show this in video to see how this looks like so we want to put this in a regular basis in a regular paths and as I said I will I will use then some gloss varnish to simulate the water of this melting snow so I will I will simulate that the snow is melting partially because of the of the battle next to the to here so so you can see it looks I think the texture is much better than what they used to have before. I think the texture is looking nice. Okay, it looks like really like a snow. Let's see when dry how how stick gets to the here I'm going to apply a little bit. Well not to cover too much the helmet. We can put. Then I recommend to put small flocks in this parts, just to. Then I will put a little bit more here. Okay. That moment, I, I, in that case, I will keep clean snow, and I think this will. 
No, it will add just some small portions of the snow. Nice. Now, what I'm going to do, is I'm going to take the miniature and I will place the miniature in the position to see how this will look like. So the middle will go there and I will press. So the miniature will go something like that on the on this base. Okay. So this is how I will let it dry now. Okay. We'll wait this, until this dries and I will show you once it dries so you can see how it's looking like. But this is the idea and now I will just I will I will Use this tool and I will try to really make it look more. Get it too much. I will make something like that. So, just you can see before it dries. I think here I put too much. You can put a little bit here. Maybe we can put a little bit as well here. and then put it we'll make this to look like patch of snow I think now it's looking good, so I will leave it here, I will wait until this dries and I will come back and show you how it's looking like once this has dried. So this is how the snow is looking like one half dry. I think it's looking quite good, a little bit chunky in some places, but I, I really like how it looks like. And also in the next tutorial I will explain in the next week how I did these icicles here. So what we are, I want to do now a little bit is I will use glossy gloss and um, varnish and we are I'm going to use hard coat to add like a little bit uh, to give the sensation of wet, a little bit of wetness. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to apply this next to the, the snow. This will simulate the snow um, like melting a little bit in that places and, and then um, making this a little bit of water in that parts. So I will apply this, especially on, on the ways the places they are pulling. I will put a little bit more. So I will put this a little bit next to this to the here. And for example, we can put a little bit here because this will flow through the rocks, and then we will have some wetness here. So I will apply this. Um, you can see a little bit of gloss varnish in some places to make it look a little bit more um, wet and, and like part of this snow is melting and is and, and, and is uh, dripping water or is, 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 is there is some water and muddy in, uh, next to it. So this is the, the look because it, indeed if it if the cannot be resting snow because then it will be snow everywhere so the snow have to be melt partially 
that's the reason why we don't have snow everywhere in on the base and I, I also do that to make this sensation that is a richer sensation no? because if you just put the snow every day, everywhere it's going to look quite flat so I'm going to apply just some gloss varnish in some places to make it look and you can also even put it just on top of the snow next to the edges to show in that the smell the, the, the snow sorry is melting in that part so I will keep doing that and doesn't matter if the you look a little bit whitey snow the, the varnish will 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 be um, fully transparent once half dry so I will keep doing that and I will show you the final result so you can see the final result once the varnish is, is dry and you will see how it's looking like so I really want to give the sensation of more white uh, surface so I will keep doing that and I come back once the varnish is dry so once the varnish have dry this who looks like we have a little bit of glossiness here like if this is melting down as well on, on the ground so I, I think I will leave it like that so this is how to do uh, how I, I did the the nose, the, the nose, the, the snow on a, on this base, and yes, I just wanted to test how it's looking like the Valayan Blizzard from Gange Workshop from Citadel, and I think it's looking quite good. But of course, I use a lot to do that, so I don't know how many how many bases you can do with this uh, with this artificial snow. That's all for this tutorial. So I hope you find this interesting, I hope you like it, and keep uh, tuned if next week you want to know how I did the icicles. I will explain this in the, uh, in the yeah, weekly painting, or weekly, uh, weekly hobby of next week. That's all for now, I hope you find this interesting, please leave the comment below, let me know what do you think, as usual. Thanks a lot for watching and see you later. Bye!